Get to know me better. Hi, welcome to my channel. So, I'm Naomi and I'm a reader. Uh, I thought I'd do a newbie booktube um, hashtag, hashtag thingy and tell you a little bit about who I am and what you can expect from this channel. What are you most excited about for this channel? I think one of the things I'm most excited about is that opportunity to find new authors and new uh, new things to read and um, take in. I think that there's so much out there to be read. I'm really looking forward to exploring the world more. Why do you love reading? Reading has always been a real escape for me. Uh, an opportunity to find out about other worlds and lots of other experiences. To make sense of other people's experience of the world. And then sometimes books reflect my own experience back at me with a different twists and a different way of thinking about it and sometimes it's that chance to find something that just made me feel seen. What book or series got you into reading? Be honest. Well I'm a child of the 70s. It was Enid Blyton. I remember our library had sh shelves of Enid Blyton books and I just devoured them. Um, they were easy to read. They they were real page turners, and they showed me a world that wasn't like my own. I think that um, which is actually one of the reasons why they're problematic, because they, you know so much is set in that middle class white British experience that of the 1950s, which was so distant from my own experience. Um, but I just devoured them and it just gave me, gave me a real sense of enjoyment in reading. So much of my other reading at that time was um, religious texts and was focused on what I should do, what I should think, and I think the Ian Blyton books just gave me an experience beyond that. What questions would you ask your favourite booktubers? Well, I think the main thing I'd want to ask is, does creating content ever spoil the experience of reading? I think that's the one thing I'm nervous of in creating a channel and building a channel because I wouldn't want to ever lose what I've got. What challenges do you think will be the hardest to overcome? Um, I think the biggest challenge will be overwhelm and a feeling of a need to put out content rather than to just enjoy doing it. And also, I don't want any anything to spoil what I get out of stories. And stories are so important to me. So, come explore stories with me. And if you've enjoyed this, please like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff.